Nightmares are better than good dreams. I still haven't found anyone that agrees with me yet, so here it goes. Waking up from a nice dream always makes me feel disappointed and messes up with my day. It's like a reminder of how mundane and unfulfilling everyday life is for me at least. Leaving me wanting to stay in bed more just to dream a little longer. A nightmare on the other hand fills me with adrenaline and gives me a nice shocking awakening with my heart beating uncontrollably. Not only do I get off bed instantly and fully aware, ready to take on whatever the day throws at me, but also feel a sense of appreciation for my current situation, knowing that everything I had just experienced was all in my head. I often experience sleep paralysis during the night as well e.g. unable to move. Seeing shadowy figures on my room walls and my heart pumping fast which I sometimes find quite enjoyable. I cannot agree at all but I love that you are able to take something that for so many of us can ruin a day and use it as fuel to make you feel better. That's genuinely really cool. I'd rather wake up relieved that something didn't really happen than disappointed that something didn't happen. So actually I agree with you. My nightmares are like a horror video game. Shit goes down but it's fucking sick. Yes bro this is my favorite unpopular opinion ever. When I have a nightmare I wake up feeling like I've watched a blockbuster movie. I think about it for a few days afterwards and contemplate what it means and actually feel something for once. The rest of my dreams are fucking asshole dreams I have to be honest dreams of doing spreadsheets. At work and shit nauseated face nauseated face wake up feeling depressed. My real life as well. It's like numb to all emotion. So nightmares for me are a release and a riveting experience. All of my nightmares revolve around my kids being in danger or all of us being held captive. No thanks. I've had great dreams where I get incredibly emotionally connected with the Chaictors. The reality truck hits hard when it robs me of the life in the dream. I defiantly empathize although enjoying the nightmare is not something I can do. Upvoted. Unpopular opinion for sure. Freddy Krueger approves. I've had some nightmares so terrible that they've messed with me for the entire day. Good dreams however give me something to aspire to and or treasure. So we do disagree. My nightmares are always about my pedo father. No thank you loudly crying. And my good dreams never leave me disappointed. I recently dreamt that I took my daughter to Disney. I can do that one day. No fucking thanks, I hate having nightmares about the people I love dying in front of my eyes. Good for you. Some people become anxious about going to sleep again after. My nightmares have been causing psychological issues so no thanks lol. Definitely unpopular highly recommend you lean into this and become an adrenaline junkie because that's what you sound like. Take cold showers in the morning. So high intensity workouts. Jump off cliffs fill your life with more adrenaline my guy. But not drugs don't do drugs. For the adrenaline junkies among us. A nightmare is a thrill ride. For reals. My dreams usually involve some level of danger threat conflict. And they leave a memory for later. I can't remember having a good vanilla dream either. And I think that's the re just vanilla. Who am I to disagree? There are nightmares and there are nightmares. Where the first is like a good action movie and the latter is a psychological thriller without a happy ending. My whole day is often ruined by those bad ones. Up dude. Guess you've never had a night terror then. It's like a nightmare but the feeling of dread and horror continues well after you wake up and go about your day. I've only had these twice in my life. But I woke up screaming and spent a good chunk of the day utterly terrified of anything unexpected. What the actual hell? 
There's no way you enjoy sleep paralysis or nightmares nightmares literally traumatize me all day. Like if I wake up from a nightmare there's no chance I won't feel weird all day. Take my upvote. Yeah. Please get back to me when your nightmares get so bad you can't ever get a decent night's sleep. I wake up multiple times a night screaming. My girlfriend doesn't exactly enjoy it either. Yeah I like nightmares as well. The rush and relief you get realizing that it didn't happen is great. The most interesting thing though, is I'm always surprised that my brain can come up with something that disturbing. That's the scary part. Agreed. I like to think of myself as an amateur lucid dreamer. When I have a good dream, it's really hard for me to realize I'm dreaming. And therefore it's hard to take over my dream. However, I'm usually able to identify that I'm dreaming when experiencing a nightmare right away. And fully take control from there. My dreams alone are stressful as fuck. They always involve school and forgetting my locker combination getting lost. Work and getting fired. Or running around town like Sonic for some reason and that's just my dreams I don't even want to. Get into my nightmares plus add in the fact that I have night terrors and fight my husband in my sleep. No thank you. Nightmares being making me poo poo in my sheets though. Yes, I can't take dreams seriously so having a nightmare is like watching a scary movie. I agree with this take 100. Hard agree. At first I wanted to disagree. But then I read your arguments and I somewhat agree. Yes, some good dreams really make me feel things I can't feel in real life. Having certain adventures and waking up finding out that was all a lie. Yeah it can stick for me the entire day. However, nightmares also fuck me up inside the nightmare. Feelings of extreme despair. Hopelessness. Watching the world end. Get nuked. I have these nightmares also quite often. When I do wake up. It is a sweet relief indeed. But that feeling inside the nightmare. Man I can't explain. Have my upvote. I hate going to sleep since 4-5 days a week I have a nightmare. Damn. This might be the king of you oh. I'd rather be sad I woke up from a good dream than have to go through a bad dream cause honestly. Being sad the good was just a dream not a big deal. This is a great post and opinion I don't necessarily agree with but can completely see where you're coming from. I've seen this post before, deja vu. Do you take Seracle by chance? I took it for insomnia a few times and it gave me nightmares sleep paralysis. When you get no chills, you get no thrills. Daddy issues. Wow that's dumb, take all of mine then lmfao. I've woken up from some horrible dreams. A loved one died or something just as devastating. And the intense relief I felt was very real. Still I don't think I'd like to have dreams like that often. Then again my dreams are usually pretty weird. I'm often lucid and I also get sleep paralysis which I've learned to just ignore until it stops. Sleeping is weird. This is my favorite opinion I've seen so far nightmares are so much. For lack of a better term. Fun? Except for that one time I woke up after being scratched by a clawed monster and there were actual scratches on me. That was weird. Nightmares reset your clock, so you break out a mental loop you can get stuck in. All of my dreams are nightmares, and I agree. Usually more interesting to recount later. Yes finally someone gets it. I typically enjoy nightmares too. Though the lady one had me walking up posing like Baphomet. That weirded me out. I've always said this, 